Hi Taurus, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading, Taurus, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading, Taurus. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the page of swords, and this is air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. So this is someone who's very interested in you, very curious about you. They could even be stalking you. They could be like looking at your social media or asking friends about you or getting readings on you, but you're heavily on this person's mind and they feel the need to do research on you. Like they feel like they want to reach out to you. They want to talk to you, but they need to get some sort of insight first. Let's see. We have the hanged man, Pisces energy, the knight of pentacles, earth energy, and the five of cups, water energy. So this is someone you have history with. In fact, with the five of cups, there was a breakup, a separation, and they are feeling the loss of you. This is someone who feels regret and they're mourning. You know, they, they, they have been stuck on you and they wonder if you've moved on. You know, this is someone who is in separation from you and they're looking at something from a new perspective. There is an energy of no contact with that hanged man. And, you know, they, this person is trying to understand something from your point of view. Like they're trying to put themselves in your shoes and they feel like they, they can't, like this person feels like they don't have the rights to just reach out to you. They have to be kind of reserved with how they do it. So they have to be cautious. So we're seeing them moving very slowly towards you. So let's clarify these cards, Taurus. Okay, so we have the Seven of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So yeah, it does look like this person, they worry uh, it, how you would receive them if the words come towards you, because we are seeing a bit of a hesitating energy with the Seven of Pentacles. Uh, they think a lot about what happened, and they, they, they do have regrets. Let's see. We have the Two of Pentacles earth energy the high priestess pisces energy and the ace of cups water energy so they are seeing you as um mysterious they don't know how you feel about them and it, it is making them a bit hesitant to come towards you like they don't know how to approach you um so they are trying to find information about you like this is someone who's trying to keep tabs on you um they are going back and forth about whether they should or shouldn't reach out or how they should do it with the two of pentacles um but this person really wants to they want to pour out their feelings to you with this Ace of Cups. They have a lot they want to say to you. In fact, they even want to offer you a new beginning in love. This person wants to make you a love offer. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you. Okay, we have luck is on your side, new moon in Sagittarius. Okay, we have codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. Yeah, there could have been some issues that really affected this relationship and this person they wonder if these things are resolvable. Let's see. And we have elegance and patience. Nature does not hurry, yet everything is accomplished. So it may take time, but this person does intend to come towards you with a love offer. 
But right now, they it's like this person, they doubt themselves even with the codependency issues. They could have been something in the past that made your relationship um, unworkable. And they are wondering if they, they have what it takes to make it work this time because their heart is telling them to come towards you. But in a practical way, they're wondering how it would work or if it would work. So it may take them some time. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Taurus. We have surrender and healthy relationships. Let go of relationships that don't serve you, including unavailable or toxic people. You deserve to be treasured by others and to be surrounded by positive people. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Taurus. I hope you have a really, really good day, Taurus. Bye, Taurus.